Hey guys, it's uh, Truncher Dan, of course. I'm doing some work on my sticking sticks today. And look at my mail. Here's a little poser. Huh. See, he's just standing up on his uh, four back legs. Uh, and now he's back to normal. Huh. I do have the female as well. Both of them are just having a bit of a stretch. I'm just sorting out their enclosure. Um, as you can see in the background, got some fresh, um, some fresh leaves and stuff in there. No, they're just having a a bit of a, a good stretch. You can see the females here, at the front, and the males at the back. Yeah, I love these. These are um, oh, um, Eurocantha calcarata, a species of them. I've really grown fond of these actually. The female is just crawling up onto my back, but luckily, you know, they're pretty much harmless. I mean, the male can do some work with his back legs if he wanted to try and, you know, try and stab me, but, uh, you know, as long as I don't give him a reason to. I'll put him in with the, uh, the leaves. And grab this female. Come on. Try and get her off. Hmm. So yeah, I mean before I think I um, overdid it with the leaves to be honest I had so much in there but I got some obviously fresh plants at the back dif a few different kinds I got all these twigs and stuff so they can hang off them if they need to molt these are secured to the top of the lid so although they're a little bit wobbly they're not going to fall out um, secured at the top really really well so there's no risk of them falling while they're climbing it and there is a bit of a water bowl in as well. I know they probably don't need it, but just to make sure they've got all the moisture they need, there's a little water bowl just down there. So yeah, that's a quick look at my uh, Eurocantha calcarata. Like a, it was a quick video, but uh, I don't like to get these out. These are more of a display um, animal. So yeah, guys, as always, thank you for watching and uh, take care.